Broader markets are uh, firing ahead even as the Nifty recovers from the lows. Sachidanand Uttekar joins in. Sachi, you had said that, you know, uh, one would uh, buy the dip. The dip has been bought. What are the levels that you're looking at now? At some point, do we see some resistance or is there more juice on the way up from here? Uh, good morning, Mangalam. Uh as you rightly said, you know, yesterday we were uh, expecting this particular dip and uh, the level of around uh, 17,580 is uh, very important. It is the five day exponential moving average. And so far for the far last five trading sessions, we have seen uh, Nifty hovering above this particular average very well. So even right now, uh, the morning dips have been bought. Uh, the 17,500 support is significant and we don't see any reasons of this particular support getting breached. So probably this is a good idea to you know accum start accumulating Nifty. Uh, overall, we are expecting a rebound back to around 17,780 on a positional basis. If you look at the intraday trading range, I think the momentum uh, on the higher side should be unlocked once uh, Nifty starts trending above 17,620 from here on. So immediate basis, I think uh, it's a good idea to, idea to uh, accumulate longs. The stop loss for Nifty is placed at 17,480. The first target for the intraday is around 17,620. But positionally, we expect this particular swing to extend towards 17,780. Okay, 17,700. Sachi, what about individual stocks? What's in your radar? Uh, good morning, Nigel. Nigel, clearly uh, uh, the theme for the day is uh, you know capital goods and cement. And when we look at cement, uh, Ultratech cement has already uh, you know been performing well. But if you look at the uh, overall structure on the daily scale, we saw it rebounding from its 200-day exponential moving average. Uh, the clear-cut RSI crossover is indicating that uh, there is still momentum uh, which is valid. Uh, if you look at the 60 minutes data as well, we have observations of a broadening structure uh, wherein uh, the upper end is placed somewhere close to 68.70. So quite a lot of headroom still available on Ultratech Cement. Still, we recommend building fresh longs here. The stop loss for the trade should be placed at 6660 and the intraday target is placed around 6870. The second stock which has been on our radar is Crompton Greece. Uh, if you look at the daily structure, there's a classic triangular formation. We have seen a fresh breakout from this particular formation. The pattern target is placed at around 440, but from a trading perspective, you can accumulate this particular counter for a target of around 425. The stop loss should be placed at 409.